It's time to do the annual stormwater inspection report for your infiltration trench. You as the homeowner can do this inspection in three easy steps. Step one, locate your letter from the county that has the facility IDs. If you lost your letter, please email us at stormwaterinspection at arlingtonva.us and we will email you in a couple days with the new inspection letter. You will need the facility ID number in order to complete the form. For infiltration trenches, you must conduct your inspection three days after a rain event of at least a half an inch of rain. You can sign up on the county website to be notified by email when there's a heavy rain event. Step two, we are taking photos. So first thing, go outside, grab your mobile device. Typically for infiltration trenches, we need two to three photos. For the first photo, we typically need a close-up of the observation well with the cat removed. For the second photo, we need an overall showing the majority of the infiltration trench. Step 3. Inspect and report. Once you've taken your pictures, take a closer look at your infiltration trench and fill out the form. You can use your mobile device. Enter the URL or search online for Arlington Stormwater Inspections and then click on the link for inspection report. Once you're on the stormwater inspection form page, enter in your email address and scroll down to the bottom and click next page. Next, enter in your facility ID and check the box that says check when finished entering facility ID and hit next page. Ensure that your information is correct, select yes and enter in the location description. Again, verify that your information is correct if you are the owner. Next, select inspector type and enter in your information if you are the person performing the inspection. Next, upload your photos. First, select the close-up photo of the observation well with the cap off. Second, upload your overall location photo showing majority of the infiltration trench. If you have a pre-treatment, you may be asked to upload a photo of that as well. Next, fill out the inspection task. First, select the date that you inspected your infiltration trench followed by the amount of rain, and then ensure that you answer each question. We will be going over each question in detail later in the video. The last step of filling out the form is to sign and submit. First, enter in your information, and then enter your electronic signature. Check the box understanding that is a legal signature, then hit submit. Your facility may have a pretreatment. If so, you need to take a photo of it. Pretreatment is the small device that water enters in before entering into your stormwater facility. Your letter will indicate whether or not you have a pretreatment. So take a look around your infiltration trench. Make sure that the area is stabilized and there is no loose or bare soil that could potentially clog the trench. This trench is actually brand new, so the area is still being stabilized. Next, check to see if there are any visible signs of erosion at the inflow or outflow points. For this particular infiltration trench, the pipes are underground, so there are no visible signs of erosion. Next, we will check to see if the infiltration trench has any debris or sediment. In this infiltration trench in particular, they have um, some leaf accumulation and some sticks, so we will just remove that. Next, we are checking the topsoil or pea gravel. This facility has topsoil, which has adequate cover, but if your um, facility does need any additional pea graph or topsoil, you can add it as needed. Next, check the pretreatment to ensure that there is no debris or structural damage done. Check the observation well and ensure that it is still capped. Then unscrew and open the cap and measure the amount of standing water, if any, in inches. If standing water is present, please check back in a couple days to ensure that there is no longer standing water. If there is, maintenance may be needed. Remember, the most important thing is to get your inspection report in on time. If we have any questions about your photos or information, we will contact you. Remember, it's better to submit something than nothing. Your infiltration trench reduces runoffs to local parks, your neighbors, streams, the Potomac River, and the Chesapeake Bay. On behalf of Arlington County, thank you.